Hello, my Ecom learners, and to everyone who are with me today. It's been quite a while since I last provided you with a video lesson. I hope you are all doing good. Again, I am Teacher Claire, and my channel offers video lessons for students and some more varied educational contents. If it's your first time here, I'd be so glad to have you with me in my YouTube journey. So please click the subscribe button like this video as well and click the bell icon for you to be updated on my next video contents today we will be dealing further with one among the most important parts of a research paper which is the title research title is considered as a significant part of a research as it windows the focus of the paper it is similar to a news headline that when one reads it he gains the overview of the current event. A research title does the same job. When one reads it, he gains a primary comprehension of the most important contents of the paper, like the problem, the suggested solution, the research participants, the location of the study, and many more. Thus, constructing an effective title means setting a clearer focus. You might wonder then if there is a difference in writing a quantitative research title versus the qualitative one. Well, today's video lesson will certainly assist you on identifying their differences. So watch this and learn. First of all, let's review on the distinct characteristics of quantitative and qualitative research. Quantitative research involves collecting and analyzing numerical data, meaning to say, it refers to the systematic collection and investigation in which a person doing the research collects data from different respondents that are based on numerical figures and the data obtained is then analyzed using different mathematical, statistical, and computational tools. Meanwhile, a qualitative research is the process of collecting, analyzing, and interpreting non-numerical data such as beliefs, perception, behavior, attitude, and others. The researcher may gather information through observations, note-taking, interviews, focus groups or group interviews, documents and artifacts in terms of forming a title remember this quantitative research has independent and dependent variables while on the other hand qualitative research has categorical variable when we say variable it refers to a person thing idea situation or phenomenon being measured in quantitative research or being observed in qualitative research. For further explanation of research variables, watch my video lesson entitled Writing Research Title, Quantitative and Qualitative, which can be viewed from the playlist folder Writing a Research Title. Now let me give you an example anyway. Look at this one. The research title is Impact of Classroom Temperature to Abbey Senior High School Students' Academic Standing This is an example of a quantitative title where the independent variable is classroom temperature as it affects the dependent variable, students' academic standing. Quantitative shows cause and effect. If, let's say, the room is cold, students perform well as they are able to concentrate and focus on classroom activities since they feel comfortable. Data may reveal that 95 over 100 students actively engage in classroom situations versus 25 over 100 students who mostly do not participate in the class when it is hot and not well ventilated. Now look at this example for qualitative research with the title Perceptions of Abbey Senior High School Students on Proper Classroom Ventilation Leading to Outstanding Academic Performance. 
From the title, the categorical variables are students' perceptions and academic performance which may be classified categorically. We may say that students may think that when classroom is well ventilated, they tend to focus more on classroom activities. Just to give you a concrete example, here's a statement with categorical variable classifications. I think a well-ventilated classroom helps us to focus more on class discussion and actively involve in activities as we feel comfortable. A. Strongly agree. B. Agree. C. Disagree. Or D. Strongly disagree. These are what we call categorical classifications. From the statement which you think, referring to students' perception from the research title, and feel, tapping on the students' responsive awareness and emotion, this are both categorical variable that cannot be counted. If most of your respondents answered A, then you may interpret that a well-ventilated classroom is a great factor leading to ensure outstanding performance of the students. And that is how you may create a title for quantitative and qualitative research. I hope you learned something from my short discussion. Again, this is Teacher Claire and if you enjoy this video, please like, share and subscribe to Ecom channel. That's it for today. I'll be with you again next time. God bless you and always remember that happiness is a choice we make so always choose to wear a happy heart.